What's going on everybody? I'm going to do a review for you today on the uh, Z, um, sorry, Joytech uh, Z510 series. Um, I got mine from Z6. It is uh, $54.99 for Star Kit. You know, there's four choices in kits you can choose from. Um, this is just a standard kit. And inside here you're going to have a little bit of an unboxing. I've been using it for about a month now, so I hard tested it. Uh, if you get a manual, you'll get um, two batteries and two atomizers. I just have one in here because I'm using one right now. This is one of the batteries that you get, and this is one of the atomizers you'll get. And then here's my little one that's fully assembled. And you also get a wall charger adapter. It's got the Joytech logo on there. And you also get a USB adapter. Your battery just screws into the end here, just like so. And you will charge and the light will turn blue when it's charging. Nice and simple. So you pretty much get everything you need to get started. It's a good kit on the two batteries for the price. It's not bad at all. Uh, good kits always have two batteries in there. Um, battery life in this kit, uh, I get about two and a half to three hours of vaping on this. Not chain vaping, you know, just pick it up for a few minutes. Pretty heavily, moderate to heavy vaping, I would say. Um, and it takes about two hours to charge, so it lasts longer than it takes to charge it. Let me show you here a few things on this. So this is the battery button. So they're manuals. And blue light on the tip. And they're all branded. My camera's very bad, but they got the Joytech logo on the battery and the atomizers. They'll be branded, so make sure not to get a knockoff because there are a lot of them out there. And then Take cartridge off here. This is your atomizer. Inside there you can see the Addy. The Addy just screws right on here. Let me give you a quick warning. When you do, mine are kind of saturated and liquid right now. So when you do get these, they do come primed and ready to go. But I'm gonna give you some advice. I ruined one of mine right away from not wetting it. So what I would do is take a few drops of your uh, e-juice and just drip maybe one or two no more than that onto the atomizer just to make sure it's primed and ready to go so you don't burn it because it is pretty dry most times um okay so then this is your cartridge i'm using a uh, it's, uh i believe this one is a slim tip no a flat uh slim tip yes because they have a flat tip also which is even thinner than this this is uh, more square and they also have round also, so they have a variety of tips. This one I find the best for me, it fits nicely on your lips. So I'm gonna put a couple drops in here. Nice and easy to fill their cartridges, just drip it right on top, right onto the stuffing. You take your cartridge, battery, pulls right in, pops right in, boom. There you go, now I'll give you a little vaping demo here. As you can see, vapor is definitely tremendous for a little cigarette. This is, I guess you would call this a, a mini cigarette. But vapor is good, throat is phenomenal. Can't ask for more from this um, type of cigarette. Uh, great flavor, but that's I'm partially because I use uh, Red Oak Johnson Creek VG formula, and I use the uh, Tundra formula. It's very good throat hit. Um, Good vapor production on this cigarette. Very good vapor. 
This is definitely one of the best I've tried, and I have a couple other ones I have tried. You can see my reviews if you uh, look at some other links on my YouTube. Um, what else can I tell you about this one? Oh, yeah, so I also ordered a personal charging case, which is this guy here. It's pretty small. Um, it fits your hand nicely, fits your pocket nicely. It's a lot smaller than most charging cases, honestly. And it's got um, a little button here, which you would press. And it swings open, it's got a little like hinge on it. And you could charge one of your batteries. This goes right in here. And once you close the lid, it pushes the battery down to contact and it will light blue, saying it's charging. And then you'll see the red light, meaning it's charging. And you could charge the cigarette probably about four times with this pack. The pack takes about three and a half hours to charge. It's good to carry your batteries on the go, because put these in your pocket, you'll press them a lot and It'll activate it and it'll drain your battery and sometimes that's happened to me so that's why I ordered this charging case. And it could hold um, some empty carts. It could also hold one of your Addies in there. So it's good storage too. It's got three spots for cartridges and one spot for a battery. That's a nice thing. It's only like 24 bucks on their website. And it's got a mini USB to charge it right there. That's another thing about that. It's really nice. They have a lot of accessories. I also have. I have a lot of their accessories. Um, a leather zip case here, which is good for storing. So I have spare addies in here, some more carts, and you could actually put three fully assembled cigarettes in here, plus little bottles of e-juice. Usually I have them all taken out right now because I'm reorganizing everything. So that's nice. And this is only 10 bucks. This is another thing nice to have. This is a little bit bigger though, take it in your pocket or whatnot. Maybe if you're a girl and you put it in your purse or whatnot. This is good for vacationing if you're going out of town and whatnot. It holds everything. Another nice thing about this is these are all interchangeable. What that means is you can go buy a uh, Ego battery from their website and you could use the same atomizer, same cartridge and screw it right onto the Ego battery and you're good to go. All you need and you get a bigger battery. Um, now also with this I have, let me show you, I have, uh, they have something called a tank system. Now for the tank system you need different atomizers. These did not come in the starter kit, I ordered these separately. And this is a tank atomizer right here. Um, on the right one, yeah. That's a tank atomizer and you can see it's different on the inside. It's got a, a little pierced fitting that pierces the cartridge compared to the standard 510 Addy. My camera's not so good, there you go. Um, and you also could buy the uh, uh, tank cartridges for your tank atomizer and it basically just pops right onto the Addy, like that. And you could screw that atomizer right onto these 510 batteries. And with these um, cartridges, you can fill, I think a little less than a milliliter of juice in there but if you're vaping you know, at home or even when you're on the go, it's more portable because you don't have to keep dripping into your stuffing because that's one downfall this has. You have to constantly keep dripping in here every couple, every couple, um, maybe half hour or so, you drip a few drops in there, kind of like lighting a cigarette. You get in the habit of doing it. This, you can fill it up and you'll be good to go for a while. And the atomizers are, I think, 10 bucks and... Yeah, I mean, it's another nice thing to have. You don't have to buy a new battery or a new setup. All you need is a new atomizer. Screw on the same battery and it's good to go. That's another nice thing. I mean, there's a lot of interchangeable parts with this. All their stuff's pretty interchangeable. Um, like I said, I'll give you another vapor test here and show you what it's like. Good throw it. I mean, you can't complain about this cigarette. You can't complain about the price. Don't waste your time on other uh, cigarettes that claim they're good and whatnot. I have some other reviews of some not so good cigarettes, and this is the one that's very, very good. This is I use this one more at home, sort of a compliment cig. I have my Ovale E Mini, which is also Joy Tech. It's just. Um, and that's what I use uh, on the go. I use this more for uh, at home. It's a nice cigarette. Just like, this is really not a great cigarette for portability. I mean, I bought the case and whatnot, so it'll be a little more portable. But the dripping of the liquid and refilling them all the time it gets kind of annoying. So, but it's still a great cigarette.
And so, I mean, get yourself that as a, as a compliment and then make sure you have, you know, all, all day going out cigarette, which is this right here. And I have a review of this one also if you want to check that one out. But, I mean, that's pretty much it on there. Um, if you have any questions, post some comments. I'm sure to get back to you on those. Uh, check out some other reviews if you need um, any other advice. Thanks.